Tree Boy, Tree Boy. Any more? Elite? So that's, uh, you remember the guy at the very beginning of the game? The cool guy gave you your flask. Yes. He's wearing the Elite Knight set, which is the, like, not canon, but it's like the poster boy set for Dark Souls 1, like the Fluted Knight set was for Demon Souls. Yeah, okay. Or the Pharum set was for Dark Souls 2. That was a waste. Yeah, the hitboxes are, are remarkably specific on spells. Um, and the guy who was wearing that, his name is actually Oscar of Astora. Blooded Moss Chump. Uh, so the reason why I know his name is Oscar of Astora is because people dug into the game's files and found unused dialogue by him, in which he was supposed to basically be, like, a buddy character or along more of the game, like Solaire. Okay. Uh, and he's a cool guy. Uh, but unfortunately in the main game now, he just bites it, and that's it for him. Oh, there we go. Fine. Why? All right, I decided to R2 it instead, for once. Oh, and the the delay messed you up. You can block those, but they they take quite the stamina. Oh, you still go. You keep coming. Oh, he has no. He has essentially infinite poise. Right, right. As he should. As he should. I'm not gonna. He's a fucking stone golem no, wearing armor. No. Yeah, clump. I'm not gonna say nothing about that. You're allowed to have infinite poise when you're a big boy. Poise is a big deal in this game. It actually works. Um, yeah, you kept saying in the previous games that it doesn't. Yeah, in all of the other ones, pretty much. But in this game, it's for real. If you wear heavy enough armor, you have hyper armor on your moves. Yeah. And bosses, in some cases, cannot stop you. Mecha Zangief. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, okay, you're a bigger room than I thought. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You enjoying your- you getting lost? I'm getting my jollies. I'm doing a big circle on it, and I'm- Are you? Uh, okay, so there's one exit here. With stones. There is, uh, a pathway there with more grass. Uh, or unless it's not. Yeah, let's just hook this wall. Hug the walls, man. Yeah, we're hugging. We're Hallwagen. We hugging now. We Hallwagen. Hallwagen? Hallwagen. I like it. It's it's old. It's been in every one. It's all one exit. Okay. Curious. <laughs> Very curious. Yeah. Yeah, that thing's super alive. <laughs> Very curious. Why'd it take so long to, to wake up? Yeah, that's a good question. Alright. So you missed a side path down there. Oh. You just walked right past. Jesus Christ. Turning around. Um, oh, it was way back. Way, way back. Yeah. So this is main path. You didn't know, dude, you're in a circle and you're 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 trying to hug the wall, but you keep going back in and out and avoiding the actual walls. So just do your big wall hug. Okay. All the way around. I did the hall wug from all the way over there to all the way over here. You did not. You went into the middle and then you missed a bunch of stuff. Oh, God damn it. See, now you're not even hall wugging now. Look. Look at this hall wug. Look at it. I'm seeing it. I'm seeing it. <laughs> now I'm thinking about vines. <laughs> See? Uh, this little, little thing is little, man. Come on. That's easy. To miss. Aw, oh, because you saw the snake earlier, that trap got ruined for you. Well, when I hear a noise and nothing moves, I immediately- You immediately turn around and run I away. I immediately turn, think it's- yeah. yeah, it's behind me. So... So what usually happens is you just go to pick that up because it looks like a branch. And then he gets- he fucking bites you. He gets me. He gets me. Partisan. You got the Partisan! It's a spear that also has slashing attacks. Solid spear. Solid? And it also has a swing that is slashing. Goes back the other way. Solid spear. And slashing. I like it. I it's, like it a lot better than the halberd. It's a workhorse. What are- ain't, ain't nothing wrong with the partisan. What's- what's the- what's its deal? It's, uh, 80? And, uh, yeah. Sea scaling on decks. No, I like that way better than this yeah. thing. Way better than that thing. That's cool, man. Yeah, if, uh, put that on the list for potential upgrades. The mental list, I mean. Yeah, oh yeah, for sure. 
I might look. And, and, uh, cause I have All right. And you know what? So that is the one thing you missed with your hall wagon on this side of the yeah, okay. hall wagon. You know what? What? I haven't played the game using anything like this up to now. Let's have some fun. Yeah. Why not? You're going to notice it's going to be a very different feel. Yeah, I'm going to have to take more swings on things. Yeah. But you're going to be far away. And you can also hold up your shield and attack. Let's give you some space. So that I can walk around that space. There you go. <laughs> By giving you some space, I'm giving me some space, eh? Fantastic. Lock on. Thank you. Okay. Finally. The battle I've been waiting for. Amazing. That was that was a really good test. <laughs> that was a really good test. It was a good test, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay. So uh, I got caught up on the bricks there. Yep. 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 Not as easy. So the place that he was is actually much more open than the place that you dragged him to. The place that he was it has no trees. Yeah. When yeah. you gave him some space, you actually stole space from yourself. I stole space from myself. I do. But now you can get back back to him. Back back to him? Back back. Uh, with your new toy. And see how you like it. Yeah, a proper test. Hi. Bye. For at least a while. And you do not run very fast in Dark Souls It's 4. such a slow run, dude. It's such a slow run. You hey, did it. Can I go over here? Ah, there's nothing. Okay. It's just bricks. Stealing you off. Okay. I'd be interested to see a spear playthrough. I'm, I'm just curious to know, because... Hey, there's your boy. No. Oh, man. Oh, jeez. You're not kidding, huh? Takes, takes a minute, doesn't it? Oh, that's a very different feel. Yep. And by different, I mean... Terrible. Oh, that's gonna take so long. <laughs> Damn it! That's gonna take so long! Yeah, because your thing's at plus zero. I know. That's, Wooly, that's why they give you the ability to just buy Titanite right at the beginning. Mm -hmm. And it's like I said, nothing will be able to compete with the Drake Sword until it's like plus three or plus four. Okay, so let's see how many upgrades it would take to get this to that state, because I like your moveset. Uh, let's think about it. Let's think well, about you, have to, you have to know how much it upgrades by when um, you go back. But just on raw comparison... It's uh, 200 versus 80 plus 11. Yeah, so it's it's a far way already. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna seriously consider upgrading it. Uh, f uh right now. So, Wooly, here's the thing, right? Yeah, yeah. Because upgrade materials are buyable and easily farmable, when you want to change weapons, you come in yeah. half an hour early... And just do it. ...and do it. And that's- that's how it is. Right? Yep. Because... It's weird, because this game, unlike the others... Uh, in the other games, like, Bloodborne's the worst one by far. It's like, you never get the ability to buy those items or farm them ad adequately... ...until, like, way after you're able to upgrade one of them. Right? Yeah. But here, that's not so much the case. Like, usually, you have the ability to catch up with any weapon that you start to use, right? But because of that, and it's viable, it's like, you have to just say, I want to start using this now and get the materials required to do it. And and that's just how it is. And the other games don't have an incredibly strong, non-scaling weapon at the beginning of the game. Well, as the Drake Sword. Where's the second one? That's a good question. You can't, you can't ambush them? Nope. Aww. I know, right? Doesn't that suck a bunch of shit? It does suck, actually. It does. Because then the knowledge is useless. Well, it's not useless. It's just, you can't it's get surprised. It's positioning knowledge, yeah. It's not really like, haha, I ambush Hey, you. read that thing in front of that door. Be wary of enemy, huh? That's not true. Yes, it is. Oh. Okay. Oh, mm -hmm. nope. All right. There's an enemy right there. Can't you see it? Almost. Oh, pretty close, but no cigar. 
Do yourself a favor. Go to the edge of that, uh, cliff. And take a look around. Like, the far, far edge. That's the furthest the bricks are gonna yeah. let me. So take a good look around. All the way around. That's a shape. Oh, did you not see it? No, I'm not seeing whatever it is. I'm seeing a shape up there. Stop moving. Yep. Turn to the right just a little bit. A little bit, a little bit. Oh, too much. Left, 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 left. Now stop the camera. What was that? What is that? What is... What do you look... Wait, wait. Oh, that's a miracle. Don't worry about that. Okay. I'm like, well, what, I don't know what that circle is. Okay, no, not the circle. But I'm trying to help you out subtly here, but it's not working. It's not working. Okay, turn the camera a little bit more to the left, a little just bit slightly. More to the left. Look above your shield. And now turn the camera a little bit around. Oh, the other way. Oh god. Now look to your left to your shield. How is that an enemy? Dude, I'm missing. I'm missing whatever. You, I, my eyes are not seeing what you're. What you're. Try, what, what I'm supposed to be looking at. Give me the controller. I'll show you. Yeah. I, or just tell me. Like same thing. Okay. Just hit the wall next to the fucking door. No, the other wall to your left. Okay. You can see a bonfire from that location, but you kept like flying past it over and over and over. I can see a bonfire from here. If you go to the edge where you were and turn the camera, see that edge, you can see the bonfire. Yes. Okay. And you looked at it about a dozen times. I was not looking at that side of the screen. I was looking in the center of the screen. Yeah, that's why I kept looking, say, look next to your shield. The shield in my hand? No, the shield on the icon. Well, guess what shield I was looking at. What am I supposed to do? Will I you? don't know, but what I, and I... Plus, be wary of enemy moves made me think I'm like, should I be... Am I supposed to just say, hit that wall and no, get the invisible no, wall? I, I, if you said the side of the screen, I would have, like, looked at the side of the screen, I guess. Anyway. Anyway, there's a bonfire for you. Okay. So, now you don't have as much of a run back to that guy. Great. Cheers. Good to know. So... Um, is your eyesight 2020 still? No, I was not looking at that <laughs> section of the screen at all. I was looking, my eyes were going from literally the middle of the screen, and once you said shield, my eyes were on my character's shield. Yeah. Not the icon representing the shield. I don't need, no need to get snippy. No, no, I'm just telling you. It, it's, no it's not about eyesight when it's not even the same area. No, that was a... Uh, 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 ill fortuitously... Uh, unrelated question. I was just curious. They wake up anyway. Now. Yeah, no, once you got the item, they're they're up. And now they're gonna be shits every time you go through here. And the vines make it a little hard to see. Just a little bit. Like the best place to fight them in some cases is like their own ambush room. Yeah. Because at least it's nice and open. And you can you don't have this shit happening constantly. Nope. It's weird, because it's a- it's a garden, it's a forest, right? But it's also heavily, heavily enclosed. Okay. How many of you wake up as a result of me just walking around the side? Uh, very few. Good. Very few of them. Now that I know... You can just hug the outside perimeter. Not walking into that one. Doesn't trigger that guy. You can hear the sounds. Mm-hmm. Great. Great, great. That's cool. I love this place. There's that ugly tree. You don't need to fuck with. There's my souls. Mm-hmm. And there's big boy. Yep, the one big boy you failed to get. And yeah, you just did a U around them. Right. I love all the animations in this game in which you slide or fly backwards while blocking. I fucking love it. Uh, unfortunately, I don't think the kick's gonna do much for him. You remind me of, uh... ...of Hades Tower. Nice. Yep. A lot. Yeah, I can see that. Their moveset, their, their, their size... Mm-hmm. They're huge. They do one thing that, uh, unfortunately you haven't seen. Nope, but I kept uh, stopping it before they did it. But, uh, that Hades guys don't do, which makes them very unique. 
enjoy your fight, bro. Oh. Okay. Moonlight Butterfly. Where have I heard that name before? I've mentioned it at one point. Uh, hmm. Alright. You gonna hang out? What are you gonna do? Charge some bullshit. Yes, that's right. Ooh, Edge, you're gonna take some shots. Ooh. Alright. So those. Those are blockable, but the damage that it regens is based off of your shield. Okay. Got it. So for now, Let's Wolves, my advice would be to put your sword back on and wait it out. And be uh, as safe as you can. That was not the same attack. Nope, he's got the two. Okay. He's got those two. And that's pretty much all he's got. <laughs> and the fact that... That's a one-shotter, though, so... Uh, and the fact that for many characters, you are unable to hit him for the majority of the boss fight. Uh, I see. Can I shoot some fire at his ass, though? You can, but he moves and the, the, the pyromancy fireballs move pretty physically slowly. Like, you're actually throwing them. They're not, like, projected underneath their own force like, uh, like soul arrows, where they go infinitely. Like, pyromancy and the soul, like, in, in fiction, have weight, and that's why they get tossed. So if you want, you can actually just run straight forward to your right. But that will proc the guys that are- Yeah, but then you hit- you walk through the boss door and they can't follow you. Uh, yeah, I was just gonna do this to proc as little as FC as possible. Mm hmm And this guy's already standing now, huh? Oh, uh, no. He always gets up. You just didn't happen to be looking at him when you- when you got him up. Oh, uh, okay. See, and that's why they're fine. Because you can literally- it takes them a while to actually stand up. And they're big slow fucks. And if you have trouble with this boss fight considerably, you can either come back, or there is a person that you can summon here. Another NPC. I see. I would say, like, a good portion of the bosses in this game have NPCs that will help you. This is different music, too. This is yeah. a very... It's also not a really classical Dark Souls boss, because this isn't a horrible creature. It's just some beautiful butterfly yeah. that happens to shoot magic. Alright. It was the butterfly that did it, I tell you. Yeah, you totally talked about a Moonlight Butterfly before. Yeah. Oh, careful. Oh jeez. Ah. Gotta gotta be gotta know which one it is. Well one's fast and the other isn't. Oh, oh it that also was... tracks. Like it tracks strong. Okay. I can survive. Yeah, okay, okay. See as long as you bait it. Decent, but not great. Oh, what's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Hey, see, as long as you get that left-right thing on, you can- you can dodge all the shit. Woo! And that's his last attack. Oh, so there's three of them, is there? Yeah. Ugh, fuck. That's not- I'm out of- uh, yeah, I'm drinking too uh, much. Ah, two-hand your sword. Go time. Got it. I That's see. the boss fight. Oh! Uh. Okay. That's the fight. <sighs> That's the whole fight. Yeah, I got no more healing from here. Now. So, do it right every time. Okay. Uh... That wasn't right. No. Uh, and the basic deal is, yeah, is that as long as you can dodge or block those decently... It's two shots. Yeah. Ah, <sighs> okay. Uh, and you would have been fine without the R2. You could have just, like, hit R1 as, as it came back up. Because the R2 takes so long with, with its animation that you would have gotten, like, two or even three R1s in that time. I was hoping for something explosive. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Powerful. Or, like, breaking his fucking skull or some shit. But it didn't happen. It's just a butterfly, Wooly. Yeah, you can just keep running straight forward. Slow run is slow. Yeah. Take a little bit to the right. Yeah, because now you started with a big U, and now you're doing a smaller U. But, like, that door is, like, right in front as long as you keep running forward. And that's a short-ass boss run. Mm, with five Estus. Mm-hmm. Ten would have done it. 
Maybe. Depends. You can easily do it with five. It's just... Well, you can do it with zero. I you mean, can. Yeah. yeah. And magic users and bow users have a fucking different fight here. Yeah. Their fight is completely different and hilarious. I, 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 like, if I could see how, like, if the pyromancy is decent on it, then, like, I could even... It's decent, but, like, good job hitting him. Because he's always moving left or right. There you go. This music's so fucking pretty. Uh, and despite the fact- that, and he's a moonlit bu moonlight butterfly. Oh man. Despite the fact that, like, it's the middle of the day in some parts of the, the world. This is one of those things of, I'm like, trying to the flow of time is convoluted in Lordran. I think that maybe, just maybe, wow. Um, like, it is nighttime when you come down here. Ah, oh, goddammit, why'd I do that? I made the same mistake again. Yep, exact, I, exact same mistake. I, I, I'm trying to see if there's a visual difference between those glows. Nope. And they're, they're not. Nope. There isn't. Okay. You, you have to react to them. Uh, the main thing is that uh, one happens instantaneously, so that's the one you should be preparing for, right? But if you roll on that one, you, you eat the, you, you recover in time to eat the slow one. Yeah. So you want to, like, base, and the, the, the fast one does the least damage, right? So you want to assume the worst, and just block the, the, the fast one with the daggers, I guess you would call it, or the little spears, right? And if you see the other two coming out, you have time to just roll right through them. Uh, and the, the biggest problem you've been having with the, 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 the middle beam, or the tracking, you actually have the easiest time with. Uh, but the, the laser beam that goes right to left, it's that you're doing it so early that you're standing up into it. Okay, it's not as fast as it looks. It's much slower than it looks. And you're also doing it from far away because it's difficult to gauge how far away the butterfly actually is from you. I feel bad for people fighting this fight without a shield. Also, the fight is harder for you because you have a shield that has garbage for magic resist. I see. Uh, there is a shield you do have access to. It's not on your person, but you do have the ability to go and get it. Uh, that has, like, 70% magic resist. I see. And it's the one that I pretty much use the whole game. Because that's a really good stat. So yeah, blocking that one is shit. Ugh, but it doesn't kill me, whereas getting hit by it without a block is totally a kill. Yeah. But it's like, block on that one, and yeah. roll on the other yeah, two. okay, fine. I'll just have to do that. Because you- it's all about cost efficiency for your health. Right, and even if just one tags you, that's fine. Getting up there, though. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Come on, butterfly. You got- get tired, get tired. And he never does it so fast that you don't have time to heal. He's going down. I love his fucking weird... Whatever the fuck that is. Yeah. Shit. Now get away! Oh, you, oh, I have time, I have time. Oh, you have time. And the explosion's not actually that big. Okay. Yeah, I was expecting something big. Now you place. definitely want that shield, yeah. and I'll just do it again, and you're done. <sighs> I love his fucking design. It's pretty. Because it's barely a butterfly. Right? Like, yeah. it's some kind of mythic beast for sure, but the spiral horn and the fucking thing floating on his back and the... Oh, I just realized something. Yeah? Moving the way he's moving yeah. really helps. Well, there you go. Yeah, 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 that makes a huge difference. Yeah, just keep doing that. You can't block I know, that. I know, I know, I know, I know, <laughs> I know. I was too slow, I was just mentally too, too slow at that point. Yeah, there you go. That's the ticket. You're doing it, Wolves. You have this one in the bag. Oh, there it is. You beat him. Congrats on your, your victory here. Very proud of you. Cool. 
So you can see how people can speed run these things into shit. Yeah. <laughs> Just... Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you got a humanity. Okay. And you got... how many souls? Oh, just five. Oh, there it is. Another 10,000. Well, that's an honest boss. Yep. 